Yo, what's up guys? In today's video, I'm going to be going for number one in the world. It's going to be pretty difficult because Muhammad Light is kind of just like stealing the number one, two, and three spot right now. <laughs> Muhammad Light is too good, man, but hopefully I'll try to take the number one spot back in today's video. If, if you guys enjoy, please make sure to like and subscribe. I'm going to go for the Gombrel here, and I'll go for my Goblin just to block some of the Spear Goblin damage and kill the Mighty Miner, hopefully. Okay, he goes for Mighty Miner, Bats Miner. I'll go for the Princess here just to kill the Bats. And then I'll Mighty Miner Bridge to predict the Spear Goblins. Okay, perfect. This is going to be a nice start right here. He's going to have to, like, log the Princess. And then he's going to Wall Breakers to pull back the Mighty Miner. So I'm going to pop the ability here. Oh, a little bit too late. It's okay. I'll log here on the Wall Breakers. He's going to have to waste something else. That's going to get, like, a lot of damage. Okay, he lets it go. I do get 800 damage, so I'll take that. He doesn't have Log and Cycle. If I go for Ice Spirit Goblin Barrel, he's just going to block the Ice Spirit. So I'll just go for my Goblin Barrel and save the Ice Spirit for his bats. Get some really nice barrel damage right there anyways. And we're going opposite lane as of right now. So always nice to be going opposite lane of a Miner Wall Breakers deck. Going to go for my Bomb Tower here for the Mighty Miner. Going to have my Goblins ready. Okay, I'm going to catch it. Perfect. Okay. Usually they put the Miner on the inside like that whenever I have like a Bomb Tower down close to it. Or like a Musketeer, or Princess, or Dark Goblin that's being tanked for they always put it into the bomb tower because you wouldn't expect that i'll go for my princess here on the spear goblins he can't poison the left side he'll have to poison the right that's kind of good for him because he can kind of switch lanes now i'll go for my ice spirit then goblin barrel hopefully he mighty miners or something to block the ice spirit perfect now he's one card behind me and cycling back to the barrel because he needs the log again to defend i'll just mighty here on his mighty my mighty miner is gonna live his will die I'll go for my log here, keep my Mighty Miner alive. I'm going to Princess Bridge, I'm going to Ice Spirit predict the bats, and then I'm going to go for my Goblins on the Wall Breakers, and I'm going to Barrel right away. Okay, perfect. That's going to be a ton of Princess damage. One more shot, maybe? Okay, that's still a lot. I'm up 1,300 right now. He's probably going to change lanes here. Um, I don't want a Princess in the back, because, yeah, okay, he doesn't change. I'll Ice Spirit here, I'll go for Goblins, and I'll go for my High Bomb Tower, just because it will help defend his Spear Goblins. He doesn't have Log and Cycle, so he has to Spear Goblins on this Barrel, so the High Bomb Tower will help defend that. A very nice bomb tower spot there, just knowing that he's going to go for the spear goblins on my barrel. I'll go for mighty miner here on his mighty. I'll go for the log. Okay, miner poisons. I'll just goblins here. Obviously, he's going to poison. I'll ice spirit here for the wall breaker, and then I'll go for my princess. That shouldn't get any damage. No! No, my tower stopped shooting. Okay, I'm going to barrel here. Right, wait, I'm about to cycle him. I'm going to goblins predict his miner. I'm going to go for my ice spirit here. Okay, perfect. I'm going to princess bridge. I'm going to barrel right away. He has the Mighty Miner, but then he doesn't have, like, anything for this because he can't Spear us since my Princess. Nice. Okay. Just a tiny bit more damage and Lightning Range. Okay, that's Lightning Range. Let's go. Yeah, GG. Very nice win there against Samuel. That's a really tough matchup for him. Can't really say anything too bad about him. He's an amazing player, but I just had a really nice matchup, and I kind of got him with a few predictions. I'm against Ian here, so this is going to be a good laugh. If, if I roll Ian, you guys have to make sure to subscribe. Ian always ends up hard countering me, so hopefully I get a good matchup this time around. And it looks like he's going to have Mighty Miner Hog Rider, so... Okay, I'm going to go for my Ice Spirit here in the middle for the Mortar. And then, I'm not going to Princess the Bridge, because he's probably going to pop the ability since my Mighty will live. I'll Goblin Stir on his Mighty. Then I'll just go for the Bomb Tower. Um, okay. He's not really doing anything right now. Probably Musketeer in the middle. Okay, yeah, he does Musketeer in the middle. I'll just go for my Princess here. To st Actually, I could Princess the Bridge. Yeah, I'll Princess the Bridge. He Ice Spirits to block, and then he goes for that. Oh, wait, he has Miner. Okay, I'm going to Barrel Prelog the Goblins, and then I'll just go for my Goblins on top of his Musk. Okay, nice. Very nice start. Already got a ton of damage. Okay, I'm just going to Bomb Tower here for the Mortar. He Mortared right at four Elixir, so he can't block it. I'm only down, like, half an Elixir, one Elixir right now, so this is nice. 400, almost uh, 500 damage lead, and we're going opposite lane again. You always want to go opposite lane of, like, any Cycle deck because... They're going to be putting all their cycle cards into the one lane, like at the bridge, so you'll never be able to get a princess off. But if you go opposite lane from them, you can get princesses at the bridge off during defense. It's really important. I'll princess the bridge again right now. Ooh, that was a good Mighty Miner. Have to give him props for that one. I'll go for my Mighty Miner here for his Mighty Miner. Then I can just Ice Spirit on that. Actually, I'm not going to waste my Ice Spirit. I want to keep it to defend the Musketeer with it. I'll Ice Spirit here on the Musk, and I'll pop my ability. Don't want to waste my goblins if I don't have to because I need it for the miner. I'm going to go for my barrel here. Okay, wait, I'm going to goblins for the miner. What? That was so aggressive. Wait, I'm going to barrel. I'm going to princess the bridge. 
He can predict it, but when he logs, yeah, now he doesn't have any elixir to defend my princess. Wait, he's gonna, like, musketeer. I'm gonna ice spear. Okay, he mighties, but that's still gonna get one more. That's an extra hit. Oh, he popped the ability. That was a good mighty miner ability. I'll go for my goblins. I'll go for miner, my mighty miner, to predict the miner. Nice. I'll go for my barrel. I'm gonna princess to, pre to predict his goblins, and then I'm gonna go for... Okay, I'm gonna log here on this musketeer. I get one extra shot because of the log. Perfect. Okay, this is looking really nice for me right now. I'm gonna ice spear here on the musk. I'll go for my barrel right away. I, I want to princess the bridge again, but he's going to predict it in the middle just by defending my mighty miner. Yeah, and now he's going to mighty. He'll probably go for a mortar with this. So I'm going to get my bomb tower ready. Okay, I'm going to bomb tower right away. Perfect. You have to be super fast in this matchup or you're going to lose. Oh, ice spirit here for the mighty miner. Oh, goblins for the miner. Okay, I'll mighty miner on it since he did do the really aggressive poison. I'll pop my ability, keep my princess alive. Ian's getting like thrown around right now. <laughs> common ian thing gonna go for my barrel right now uh, this dude is so lost i'll princess again i'll go for my oh nice okay i'm gonna ice spirit here on the musk i'm gonna go for goblins protect the princess okay i'm gonna go for barrel prelog for the goblins okay ice spirits i'm gonna princess bridge okay i'm gonna ice spirit here for the goblins perfect one extra shot let's go okay wait he's not back to goblins or log so i'm gonna mighty miner here behind my tower so he can't miner and then i'm just gonna go for my barrel he doesn't have anything good for this i'll bomb tower here for the mortar yep he musketeers and ice spirits but i still get one shot on the tower and this is looking like game right now only like a light two lightnings plus two logs finish it off all goblins here for the miner really obvious placement this dude has no idea what he's doing <laughs> okay i'm gonna go for my barrel i'm gonna princess at the bridge right away okay let's see what he does okay mighty miners I'll go for my bomb tower. I'm going to outcycle him. I'm going to ice spirit here. I'm going to go for my barrel. I'm going to pre-log for his goblins. Nice. He got predicted again. Oh, it didn't even jump. Okay, wait. I'm going to princess bridge. And that's game. Let's go. <laughs> Ian just got completely destroyed. <laughs> Dude looked like he was lost. I'm in the next game here against SM. I'm just going to go for my ice spirit barrel here. I know that he's playing golem pump. So it'd be a pretty nice matchup for me, I think. This guy doesn't play with Barb Barrel, he plays with the Bomber, so that's why I feel like this is pretty nice for me. I'll just go for my Mighty Miner here on the Dark Prince, and then I can go for Lightning. I'm down 5 Elixir right now, because we did uh, 4 for 4 Ice Spirit Barrel versus Dark Prince. I Lightning the Pump, so I'm down 1, and then I have a Mighty down, so... I'm down 5, but I have a Mighty down. Okay. We're, I'm only down 1 now. It's probably closer to equal, just because I did play a card first, so he leaked a little bit of Elixir. Goblins will counter, so I'm probably down like one and a half right now. I don't know if you guys like when I do this, but sometimes I like to think out loud, or sometimes like you guys want me to think out loud, but I'm not sure how many of you guys like actually like me thinking through like their elixir and cycle out loud. Okay, you just messed up the King Tower activation though, that's really nice. <laughs> Let's go for my princess here. Because I know like I know what their elixir and their cycle is, but I never like explain what it is or how I know. Stuff like that. So if you guys want to see a bit more of that, ooh, let me know it down in the comments. Okay. Goes for the bomber. That was a really bad bomber. He doesn't have E-barbs. He has Dark Prince Lumberjack. So this is, yeah, this is just good for me. I'll log here on the Dark Prince. And then I'll just go for my Ice Spirit. I'll go for Barrel in the middle. Doesn't have NATO. And then I'll go for my Princess. I can go for my Goblins as well. It will full counter. He ignored the Barrel to pump. That was garbage. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to Mighty Miner at the bridge here on the right. What does he even have? Nah, he's going to Phoenix and then Bomber. I'm an idiot. I'm going to pop just to hit the Phoenix, but I'm stupid. He's going to Bomber. That's my bad. Damn, okay. Yeah, it was stupid from me. I forgot that he had Bomber and not Barb Barrel. Because that would have worked against a Barb Barrel. Oh, Mighty still got 800 damage. <laughs> Let's go. I'm going to Barrel here right now because he's about a Golem. Perfect, okay. Now he has to sack that. He doesn't have enough for NATO right away. And after you take three hits, what's the point of even defending it? Okay, I'll Princess in the back here. He's going to make a really big golem push. I'm down quite a lot of elixir. I'm going to Bomb Tower here. This is, looks stupid, but I'm going to Mighty Miner here on the left on the Lumberjack instead of the right. Because the Bomb Tower will kill the Dark Prince behind the golem anyway. I'll Ice Spirit here to freeze it. I'll go for the Log and then I'll go for my Princess right away just to finish it off. I'll wait for the Bomber to lock on. Then I can go for my Goblins. I'll go for the high bomb tower here, pull the, both the golems in. Really nice. The phoenix is going to respawn, but I'm not really too worried. I'll log here on everything. I'll go for the high mighty, pull in the phoenix lumberjack. Oh my, look at that defense. Hold up. Okay. I'm going to go for lightning here on the golem and the phoenix. Wow, I only took 100 damage. 
<laughs> that defense was amazing. Okay, I'm going to keep saying good game because this guy said good game to me last time when it wasn't really a good game. And now he's not saying it back, so I'm just going to keep saying it. <laughs> sometimes I like to BM people by saying GG. It gets annoying sometimes. I'm in the next game here against Retta. I know that he's a giant graveyard player, so should be a pretty easy matchup. Not just because the matchup's easy, but just because this guy's really bad. I mean, giant graveyard players are known for being garbage at the game anyway. So I'll oh, Princess in the back here. See what he wants to do. He goes for the giant right away. <laughs> of course. This guy does have zappies, which makes it quite a bit harder. And he also ignores my goblins, so that's nice, I guess. <laughs> okay. I'll just go for my bomb tower here in the middle. Oh, he goes for zappies. Okay, those zappies are going to get splashed by my bomb tower. And then when I log... Okay, wait. I'll log the graveyard and the zappies here. We'll finish off the zappies. Mighty will get a lot of value. And then we'll just goblins on defense as well. Only going to take a tiny bit of damage here. Mighty Miner goblins got the rest covered up. Nice. This is looking good already. He has to defend my... Mighty Miner. Okay, I'm not going to ability here. There's no reason to use my ability just because he just minions on top of it anyway. So what's the point? Wait, what? He minions the back. I'm going to pop the ability here. Okay, I got 500 tower damage and I hit one of the minions. That's better than nothing. I'll go for my princess here on the minions and then I'll go for my barrel straight away. He has the arrows on this and then he doesn't have anything good for my barrel. What, what does he even do here? Fireball? You have no elixir. Wait, I'm going to ice spirit. I was going to Mighty Bridge, but he would have just late Zappy, so no point. Okay, I'll go for my Mighty Miner here on top of his Giant. Then I'll Goblins to block the Zappies. I'll Princess to snipe the Zappies, maybe. Okay, never mind. I got a little bit too antsy there. <laughs> Wait, actually, he can't do anything. If he Zappies middle, I log. Okay, yeah, I'm going to log these. Zappies are dead. Okay, he Bombers. I'm going to go for Barrel right now, force him to use his arrows. He has to... He Minions? Wait, into the Princess? Okay, nice. Wait... I'm going to I'm gonna Ice Spirit Goblins at the bridge here. He's going to Fireball at, Z, at uh, 4 Elixir. So I'm going to Princess the bridge right away. Nice. Okay. Wait, he's going to Zappies. I'm going to Bomb Tower predict the Zappies right now. Oh, okay. He put them on the side, but that would have been sick. No! He has to Bomb or I Finger Slipped. Oh, that's annoying. I would have got so much more damage if I didn't Finger Slip. It's okay, though. That was still a really nice sequence by me. Would have been a lot cleaner if I didn't mess up my barrel, though. Damn. Okay. Bomb tower still kills the bomber. Oh, Goblin's the bridge here. Force him to defend this or he's losing the tower. Okay, bait out the arrows. I'll Princess the back. I'll Mighty the back. And then I'll go for my barrel. He has to, like, waste zappies or minions. He, he, he goes for minions. Minions are still going to die to my princess. I'll Ice Spirit here, block the zappies. And then I'll uh, also go for my goblins to keep blocking them. I'll Princess the back, help out against the graveyard. I'll go for my barrel. I'll log on the graveyard. I'll goblins again. Yeah, this is game. He can't do anything. He has to arrows these princesses. I'll pop the ability here just to go opposite lane. I'm going to Princess Bridge. He's going to Minion, so I'll go for Ice Spirit to kill them. Oh, let's go! Nice! Okay, I'm going to go for Barrel in this game. I'm going to BM this guy as well, because he BM'd me last time when I was playing a different deck, and he's just a garbage giant graveyard player anyways. <laughs> let's go. Played that match super well. Didn't really give him any opportunities. Only made that one mistake, but it was more of a finger slip than a mistake. I'm in the next game here against Pedro. Just going to go for my log here on the Spear Goblins. It guess it's going to be like a Mortar Bait deck. He's the best Mortar player in the world, so... Okay, nice. I do get some damage there. He does a late Goblin Gang. Probably wasn't expecting Barrel. I'll go for my Goblins here on this Goblin Gang. That's for Skelly King, so... Probably just gonna be like the Mortar Cannon Cart Flying Machine deck. Okay. Pretty nice to have Lightning against the Flying Machine, so... Go for my Princess here. I'll go for the Log. That was a really aggressive arrow. So he thought I'd Goblins right away, but I didn't have them yet. I'm gonna Ice Spirit Barrel right now. He has to go for, like, Spear Goblins. Okay, those were good Spear Goblins. It's not going to hit the tower. But this is still nice for me. I get a lot of damage there. 1,000 damage. I feel like trading damage isn't that good for me either. Oh, you're kidding. He has the Goblin Hut deck. <laughs> when I thought I was going to get a normal match, I faced the Goblin Hut. Oh, Goblin's here to protect. Oh, wait, he just lost. I'm going to barrel. That's going to be really good damage for me. He has the Goblin Gang, right? Yeah, he got it down barely. Okay. Princess is going to get a crazy amount of value. I'll go for Log here, finish off the Goblin Gang, and then I'm going to Mighty Miner at the bridge because he might Skelly King. No! Now he's just going to Spear Goblins on the Mighty Miner. Oh, I'm stupid. Oh, I didn't think that he'd arrows like that. That was well played by him. I mean, I guess this is the reason why he's like the best Mortar player in the world. He just knew that I was going to do that. Yeah, he's probably saw me do that to someone before or something. Because wasting your arrows there looks like it's stupid, but it worked out because I did the wrong play. Okay, 
a princess here for the spear goblin hut then i'll go for my barrel straight away he doesn't have spear goblins for this he only has skelly king yeah so I, I, I still get good damage out of it just not as much i'll bomb tower here for the goblin hut okay nice bomb tower is nice against goblin hut i'll just i'll let that go maybe he'll pop the ability in and i can get a nice log okay i'm gonna goblins here for the skelly king he's in the ability i'll go for my log right away okay i'll go for ice spear oh he will okay he thinks he thinks it's comedy hour with that i'm just gonna bomb tower here for the gang i'll barrel right away that was really aggressive okay i get one hit on the tower i'll go for my princess in the middle princess gets so much value in this matchup it's even though I hate this deck, it's pretty rough for him, not gonna lie. I'll go for Ice Spear at the back. I'll Bomb Tower here just to protect my Princess. I'll go for a Barrel right away so we can't Minion Horde down the middle. This is his last card is Minion Horde. I'll go for my Princess here for the Skelly King. Princess is just so good against this deck, dude. Because they they don't have like enough time to Arrows because my cycle's too quick. And then if they Arrows, I get a new one down, and then they have nothing for my Barrel. Okay. Spear Goblins in the back. I'll just go for my Goblins here to protect. I'll log on the Spear Goblins. I'll Mighty Miner for the Skelly King. I'll Barrel right now. Maybe on the side because he's going to gang. Nice! Okay, perfect Barrel placement. Alright. I'm just going to go for my Princess in the back. I'll just put it on the side to snipe the Goblin Hut. Okay, I'll just go for my Ice Spear here at the bridge. Oh, well, he gave up. Nice. Okay, so that's going to be game. Thank you guys for watching. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.